Hallelujah, praise. Master Jesus, everyone joining. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Blessings. Hallelujah. Glory to God in the name of Jesus. The Bible says, my Bible tells me that this is a new day. It's a new day. Hallelujah. Speak this word to yourself. Hallelujah. Touch, hit, hit, hit your hands on your chest. Call your name and say, Bazi, it's a new day. Call your name that the Lord has made that we should rejoice and be glad. So any other word declare upon your life this day is not for you. So the Lord made this day purposely for you to rejoice and be glad. Job 38, have you commanded thy morning son? This word is coming to position something in the realm of the spirit. For as many that are joining, I don't care the time you are coming across this video. It might be in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening or in night time. Listen to me. Before your day clock to 24 hours. This day will not end up without you receiving a word of testimony in the name of Jesus. This prophetic word title says, Someone after the separation with you is now in deep pains. Someone after a separation with you is now in deep pains. Welcome to Prophetic Blessings. If you're seeing this face for your very first time, by the help of the Lord, I am the young man that has stand the gap to bring us God's word in the name of Jesus. Please, 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 and please, I beg you, if you're watching me and you have not yet subscribed, please, hallelujah, please subscribe in the name of Jesus. Thank you for subscribing. Hallelujah. Someone after separating with you is now in deep pains. The Lord revealed to redeem. Most of the time, there are people when they are into a relationship, the people, because <laughs> one thing I tell people whenever I see a relationship that is not built on true love, I know. When I see couples together, I know what brings them together. Automatically, I look from a distance, I know. Hallelujah. As a servant of God, physically, both with the physical and the spiritual eyes, there are things that I look with the physical, there are things that I look with the spiritual eyes. I know. So whenever you see a relationship, any relationship, there must be an upper hand. Somebody that domain. Either the man will have the authority or the woman must have the authority due to one or two things. If the woman has, hallelujah, some certain things, let me not call names. She must domain because she has those things. And the man must stay quiet because if those things are in that woman, she must domain over you. So now, imagine yourself in such a relationship. So when you're living with a, in, in a relationship whereby you, the man, you're the one backing the woman. The woman can break up with you anytime. She will not feel any pains. When you are into a relationship with a, with a woman, that you, the woman, you are the one begging the man. The man can break up with you anytime. He will not feel no pains. I want us to see that any man that domain in any relationship can easily turn his back and will, not, will have nothing to lose. Will have nothing to lose. But that particular spirit, that pride, that spirit of that dominion has made a lot of us feel as if we are the only one in that position. Don't look down on people's daughter because you think you are rich. Don't misuse people's daughters because you think that, that maybe eh, I have cars, I have money, I am this one. Don't, don't, don't maltreat people's son because you think you are a beautiful girl. Listen to me. Beautiful girl without Jesus, you are nothing. Are you not seeing more beautiful girl than you dying every day? You wouldn't be an exception. There is an appointment. Let a boy or a girl not deceive you. You came to this world alone. You will stand before God alone to give an account for yourself. Hear me? You will stand before God alone to give an account for your life. What are you doing? Mm. because God has blessed you. You think that you can bring that everybody? No. No, people of God. 
Hallelujah. This particular prophetic word title, Hallelujah. Someone, after separating with you, is now in pains. Because after the separation, they thought that they had money. They thought that they were beauty. They thought that they would never find somebody as them. They thought that you would never rise. You hear me? Our God is a God that lifts a man today, bring another man down tomorrow. Yes. Anybody can be replaceable. Somebody will say, no, I am blessed, I'm blessed, I'm blessed. Listen to me. Even if you are blessed, even if you have the money, you will not live forever. One day you will join the Lord as you go. That is your own time that has ended. Child of God, listen to me. Everybody can be replaceable. I know of a great prophet called Prophet Isaiah. He was replaced. Moses was replaced. I myself can be replaced. So whenever you are into any relationship, be careful. Don't think that you are the only one that know how to break the heart of people. Hallelujah. As you're breaking people's heart every day, every day, every day, every day. God knows your match. The devil will package something good. You will focus your mind that this is the real what I want. Listen, that thing, that, listen, it will be a payback time. Somebody after separating with you thought that you'll never rise. Thought that you'll never make it again. But right now they are shocked. I'm telling you right now, they look at you, they are shocked. They can't believe this is you. They can't believe this is actually what you're doing. But my prayer for somebody under the sound of my voice. Dry bones are rising again. Anyone under the sound of my voice that was disappointed by any man or woman mocking and insulting you that you will never rise. May the God that is the lifter of man lift you in the name of Jesus. May this God that is the lifter of man lift you for in Jesus' mighty name. Marokodia shakataya. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen.